Four o'clock, just got to the campsite around three. Um, had a long, longer hike day today, about 11 miles, mostly flat. There was about five miles of the trail that was just this, like flat on a dirt road. Picnic table where I'm making dinner. I'm swing here, so I'm gonna read. There's like a one of these things. And then I have my tent set up there. There's a well. In the distance, there's a privy. We can go to the bathroom. And there's even a kitchen pavilion with more tables and shelter and a, a sink where you could just like, no running water, but you, for drainage, gray water. All right, Sunday morning, had a little late start today, um, but just uh, across this little brook right here. Uh, it was challenging, but I had my spikes on and my poles and I was able to do it fine and then waterproof boots so I just made sure the water didn't go you know, above the boot line and just uh, stayed shallow and made sure I had a good grip and I made it. Awesome. Continuing on. Alright, top of Bear Mountain, Connecticut. It is Tuesday, January 17th. 2017. I'm just nearing the end of my Appalachian Trail Connecticut section. Coming down the north side of Bear Mountain in Connecticut was very steep, very icy, very difficult, and uh, I wouldn't do it with micro spikes again. <laughs> All right. Well, I am. The parking lot. There's my car. And through the parking lot is all ice. Right now it is literally like frozen shut everywhere. So basically it's, it's freezing rain happening and without the right gear, easy hypothermia. I'm in my full head to toe rain suit. We're fully protected. So let's go on Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Monday, it's Tuesday night right now, probably around 6, 5 or so. And I'm really excited for food, I, that's what's been motivating me, that's what motivated me to, I mean I have extra food, that's what motivated me to end the trail, or not, because I easily, could have easily stayed another night at one of many campsites along my route today, but really wanted to just stop now, and yeah, stop tonight. My poles are actually ice. Everything's waterproof. I was mostly doing like eight or nine miles a day, and then one day pushed 11, and then today I pushed, I think, like 13 or I think around 13 or 14. Yeah, it was mostly the winter short day limiting me. I could have done a little more each day if it were lighter out more, um, but that's what happens in the winter. And in the winter you have a heavier pack, so it's a little slower. All right, so I think that's it. I'm gonna put my stuff in the car and get in the car and change into some. Uh, dry clothes. Well, I mean clothes while I'm sweating, but they're not so good. Okay, bye. <laughs>